Okay, so today's video is what I got for Christmas and my birthday. A lot of you over on my Instagram channel, which is down below, um, have asked me what I got for Christmas and also what I got from Disneyland Paris and if I got anything nice for my birthday. And um, <clears throat> the answer to that is I got spoiled rotten and um, I have some lovely family um, members and friends and um, yeah they know me so well. I just want to say that in no way am I bragging of anything like that. I love personally watching these videos because um, it gives me inspiration of what I can buy someone um, throughout the year and if you're like me and you're a Disney nerd then some of these gifts could be for that Disney um, um, fan you have in your life, that is for sure, because um, a lot of people got me lots of Disney. Win-win indeed. So I've collected this all together, I've put it into categories and I'll show you what I got. So let's start off with my favourite, Disney. So there was two things I really, really would wanted from Disneyland Paris this year, and that was the two spirit jerseys. Um, they released a special Christmas spirit jersey this year, and I was so excited to hopefully get my hands on it. It released in November when the um, Christmas season started, and it sold out like hotcakes. And basically, it was a limited amount of um, spirit jerseys left when I got to Disneyland Paris, and it was basically just have a look in the shops and see if it's there and um, so after like day three i gave up all hope that i would find this spirit jersey and when we went to walt disney studios my mother-in-law was walking past like this like um cart which had like merchandise on and it had like a little shop just behind it and as she was walking past she was like it's there and there it was the spirit jersey so it has a mickey mouse with his santa hat it has this gorgeous tartan print on um also on the sleeves and at the back it says merry christmas and it has the tartan at the back as well this is not in the size i really wanted it is an extra uh, extra large and it is far too big on me um but this is just to slouch around in um around the christmas time and yeah, it's so cosy. I wore it on um, Boxing Day um, and yeah, I I just adore it. I absolutely love it. Um, yeah, it just made my Christmas. So I was very lucky to receive this. That was from The Hubster. So the other spirit jersey I got was this one. Um, this is the classic um, Disney um, spirit jersey. So it has the big D and it says established in 1992. And at the back it has Disneyland Paris on the back, which goes onto the sleeve. Um, plain black. Um, this is meant to be oversized, so um, the medium fit me lovely. But I wanted the large just for that oversized feel. And um, I was so happy to get my hands on a spirit jersey. And I'm so happy now that I can finally wear it. One of my lovely friends got me this gorgeous Mickey bracelet. How stunning is that? Um, it is, it's gorgeous. It's silver and it has Mickey there. Um, and then he can fasten at the back. And um, yeah, it is stunning. I can't wait to, to add that to my Disney jewellery for sure. And I think it's a piece which is not in your face so you can actually just wear it as a normal bracelet it's only when you get close that you can actually see it's disney but me i will know that i've got disney on me it is amazing my brother-in-law and sister-in-law got me some pajamas some cozy feel pajamas and um, with my favorite um brothers on so you've got chip and you have dale and um, these are so cozy um i adore them and um, they're long sleeved as well so it'll keep me nice and warm and once again now that i've hauled them i can wear them can't wait gorgeous sticking with chip and dale on christmas eve um we had a very special character meal um that christmas eve meal um is bought um by my mum and dad my mum and dad every year when we go they always treat us to our christmas eve meal last year we went for christmas day meal they paid for that and this year we went we decided to go for christmas eve it's a very very exclusive meal at disneyland paris and it is such 
a wonderful experience and I am lucky enough and fortunate enough that my mum and dad pay for that for us and um, it is amazing so that was a present of my parents to us as a family and it was very very much appreciative um, the vlog will be coming up soon from that experience it is stunning and i had from that meal i had the most amazing incredible character meet with my favorite character which is chip and the children got me this cuddly toy to remind me of that character interaction with chip it was amazing and um, just a lovely little meet and yeah and this is so soft they're doing these plushes it's really really soft grace got um, a stitch in pyjamas for Christmas and he is the same material as this and it is so soft and squidgy and he'll be placed on my bed with all my other little um, cuddlers. He's adorable. Sticking with Chippendale, I treated myself um, to some new mittens for Disney. Um, so you've got Chip and you've got Dale. Um, I saw a lady wear these and they just looked adorable. Um, so I went hunting for them and I found them in the frontier, in the frontier land um, and they're all fleece lined inside and yeah, they're just gorgeous. Then I received a mini mouse perfume. Um, this bottle alone is absolutely stunning. I don't know what the perfume is like. Um, but um, yeah, this, the bottle alone is worth it completely. I adore this and it'll look absolutely stunning on my dressing um, table. So very, very pleased with that. Sticking with the Minnie Mouse, I received a new eyeshadow palette. I absolutely love um, the Disney um, palettes, which they do in Primark. I have a few of them, Ursula, I've got Aladdin, I think I've got the Dumbo and I've got Beauty and the Beast. I absolutely love them. The pigmentation of the eyeshadows is absolutely amazing. You don't get any payoff, so it doesn't go down onto your eyes. And the colour palette in here is absolutely stunning. Um, so it opens up and there are all your shades, really, really neutral, really, really nice. Um, all your shades, you get a mirror just there. Then here it has a drawer and you can open it up and it has a, a two highlights in the bottom. Such a lovely um, little gift and yeah, I absolutely adore this. Then the hubster and the children got me this stunning necklace. It has an R on it and then if it, if it zooms in, I do apologize about my nails. I took my false nails off because uh, I've got a netball and um, they've gone minging. I do apologize. Um, so it has a Mickey there and it has an R. Um, absolutely stunning. I was over the moon to receive this on Christmas day. Um, yeah, I can't wait to wear that as well. Because once again, it's not over. It's not like in your face like Disney, but it's just a little bit of Disney. Um, and I adore that. Then I got some Mickey Mouse mints. I adore these uh, mints and I've received one of these in my stocking. Then in my stocking I got these badges. It says best day ever and it has the Disney Castle and the Walt Disney Studios Tower. This is to go on my pin board just over there to remind me of my magical time at Disney. Then the last item which is Disney related is for my birthday off my in-laws. I received a ticket to go and see the Lion King musical, which is the which is the West End show. They are taking it around on tour, and we are going to see it um, at the Alhambra Theatre in Bradford. Um, oh my goodness me! Cannot wait to see this. Um, yeah, it's going to be amazing. That is for sure. Um, so I was very lucky indeed. We're all going as a family. So there's Michelle, Alan, Max, Grace, myself, Chris, um, Vicky and Dan. Um, each of us have got a ticket for our birthday. We know that we are getting this for our birthday um, and it's very, very much appreciated. It's going to be an amazing time with the um, gang and um, I cannot wait for this. Then a very special gift which I received at Christmas off my in-laws um, was this box. And I was very intrigued to open it up and inside has two baubles, one's red and one's lilac. And then when you open them up, it's like ribbon inside and we're like oh they're pretty and then Michelle is like read the ball but read the message um, and the message inside says dear mum and dad this ribbon is very special because if you take it out and measure it you'll remember how little I was in 2009 so that's Grace's 
and that's Max's. So basically you take the ribbon out and it will measure how tall Max was in 2019. What a very special little gift and um, I think it's a tradition which will carry on in the future. Um, really, really special and something to add to the Christmas tree. Um, really, really cute. Loved it. Then I got this journal. I I adore Michelle Obama. She's an incredible woman, um, and I read her book Becoming later um, early on last year. Um, my friend knows how much I adore Michelle Obama, so she got me the journal. Um, inside has some beautiful quotes from the book, and then you can write your thoughts and feelings in it. I adore this. Then I received two types of journals. I received this little diary which has hedgehogs on. I adore these kind of journals where you can look at the month uh, like an overview. This is for work so I can write all my work hours so I know what I'm doing within the month. And then I got this off my parents, which is a really gorgeous um, 2020 diary. I love having a diary like this, where it's a weekly one here. Then you can write like notes, etc, etc. This is to keep up with like school activities, things I'm doing day to day, but nothing to do with um, work. Um, if I've got any meetings, I've, I've like YouTube things if I want to record videos um, etc etc this is going to be news for that so yeah I adore both of these journals then a gift I received um, for my birthday was this stunning purse I've wanted a new purse um, I have a Michael Kors one and I've had it for many 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 years and the leather has started to go on it and it's looking a bit a little bit tatty let's say so I was in need for a new purse so my brother-in-law and sister-in-law got me this purse it's um, from River Island it's absolutely stunning I love a purse like this and um, where you open it up you can put uh, money in there and then your cards it is stunning and I cannot wait now to use it thank you then the kids got me one of these I think it's called an octopus octopus flexible tripod I was in desperate need for one of these and um, also it, well it's all right for vlogging when you're out in public because it keeps the camera um, settled um, yeah and also as well you can like wrap round, you can wrap this round different things and um, so yeah I was very very happy to receive this um, from the kids for my birthday so thank you kids from my nana I got a m and voucher to spend um cannot wait to be new uh, use this um I'm not a very much of an M&S kind of clothes kind of girl, but I'm all into M&S food. So I think I'll be spending this on M&S food, like puss pigs. And um, yeah, for that, and keeping it for a special occasion for the food, like maybe Valentine's Day, like buying the Hubster a nice meal or something and treating ourselves to that. I don't know, but it was very, very much appreciated. Chocolate sweets. I got loads of it. This is only some of it. Um, lint chocolate balls off my mum, a Kinder Breno off my mum, I got these in my stocking for Turkish fries and some gingerbread, um, gingerbread Cadbury's chocolate and now I'm back on plan, these will be all be sinned that is for sure and um, yeah this is how I'll be spending my sins in the future. So the first candle I got was this one, which was in my stocking. It is from B&M. It says, oh, happy days. And why this candle is so special is because it reminds me of the Disneyland Hotel. If you've ever been into the Disneyland Hotel, it has a certain smell. It is divine. And this candle is as close as I'm going to get to remind me of the smell of a Disneyland hotel. So I cannot now wait to burn this in my living room and to be able to remind me of my holidays. Um, it is divine. Auntie, I got this Yankee candle. Ooh, a fancy Nancy candle. I don't really um, buy Yankee candles just because there's so many like good dupes out there like home bargains, your B&M, etc. But I am more than happy to receive a Yankee candle this is clementine um, spice i actually thought this would be a candle which i put away for christmas this year however it's not um like like a gingerbread orangey smell and um, it doesn't remind me of christmas whatsoever it's a really fresh um orange smell so this would be perfect to burn like in the springtime then I got lots of Christmas Yankee melts to burn because I have an electric and wax melt. So these will be put away for this Christmas and I have lots of new wax melts to burn over the Christmas period. 
Then I received these candles. These are from Aldi. I absolutely love Aldi's candles because they have a dupe for a Jo Malone and they burn gorgeous. So I got number one, number three and number ten. Um, so the scents are lime and basil and mandarin, um, pomegranate and I think that's bitter orange. Um, the box is absolutely gorgeous and I know that they're doing a massive one as well for £20. Um, so yeah, so which one, whichever ones I like, I might um, knew some of my birthday money because I did receive some money to buy the big version of this and put it in my dining room on the dining room table and um, yeah so I was very 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 happy to receive these then I got a bottle of Jimmy Shoe perfume and um, this is one of my favorite scents and um, it's an, my everyday perfume that is for sure and they must have known because I just ran out of my Jimmy Shoe so now I've got a brand new bottle to use my consultant got me this little um, hand cream and nail file set. It was a thank you gift for um, me helping her out um, throughout the year. It was very much appreciative and um, very surprised to get it um, because I, I don't do it for, for anything like that. I do it because I enjoy it um, and it also for me it gives me that commitment to go to group. Um, but yeah, it's absolutely stunning. Then I got a gingerbread bath fizzer. Then I got this gorgeous makeup bag. It's from Calf Kits um, and it has an R at the front and it's like in this velvet, um, a velvet feel. Um, I won't be using this as a makeup bag. I'm going to be using this in um, my handbag, which will have like my pens, my um, lady, um, lady things in here, um, a lip balm, things like that. So it's just easy to grab out of my handbag. I will be using some of my birthday money to treat myself to a new handbag. Um, I'm in the lookout for a new handbag. I want one with like where I can put it over my shoulder and it has a zip. Those type of bags don't have a zip. They just have like a a press stud and I'm all for security and um, so if you do see one then please tag me over on Instagram or let me know in the comments if you see a bag like that because I am in need for one so this is going to go in my new handbag beauty products I got some gold I um like eye mask things which I cannot wait to use because the gold ones are meant to be amazing I got a bath fizzer this is a pineapple bath fizzer my mum knows me so well she got me a dream catcher um tree called moon i adored the cozy apple one and um, and then she got me this dream catcher one it's got fig pomegranate and vanilla these make the most bubbliest baths whatsoever and the smell is amazing and um, this will do me about four baths um and you really don't want to use it because once it's gone it's gone and it's so upsetting um yeah they're amazing so i was so so happy that i got one of these and then i got some face uh, face and foot masks i love these foot masks so this is the foot pack and this is a charcoal detox mask something which i haven't got here um, is i got an outfit from my parents for my birthday i got some gorgeous gorgeous shoes with like studs on them and then I got a black dress with like a choker um, which has got all like diamonds on I currently wore it for work yesterday so it's in the wash and the shoes are downstairs and I really wanted to record this um so it is stunning I got that off my parents and um, I got treated to some bits and bobs while I was up north you know when you go out shopping with your mom and you're like Oh, I like that. She's, I'll get it for your birthday, and then you have it then. So I've been treated loads and loads by my parents, so it's very much appreciative. Um, and then from the hubster for Christmas, um, we we don't really buy each other anything. I was very pleasantly surprised to get um, my necklace. That was a very like. I was very very surprised to receive that, and also my chip cuddly toy, the spirit jerseys. I um, we bought them, if you know what I mean, but we just kept them. Or Christmas for the children to see that Santa had bought them kind of thing um, but our main gift um, for Christmas um, is our gift to Disneyland Paris and um, that's what we save up throughout the year um, and we just love making memories in that way and um, yeah this is just a, a selection of things things I have received from other people but I've probably eaten it I've drank it and I've put it away and um, this is just the product the stuff which I need to distribute more upstairs than downstairs so I've kept it to a side so if you are a friend of mine or a family member watching this and you're like 
I bought you this, then it's very much appreciative. It's just I'm currently using it or I have used it. So I got a lot of bath bombs as well, um, which I have I've, I've used because they were like Christmas ones. So I've used them. Um, so yeah, that was everything I got for Christmas, my birthday and things I got around at Disneyland Paris. So I hope you've enjoyed this. As always, food optimizers sending huge positive thoughts. Rachel. Bye.